Hi folks, Canadian Prepper here. So today I just want to quickly share with you a new product that we're going to have at CanadianPreparedness.com. Now, some of you may remember I reviewed this item about six months ago. And uh, because it did so well in my testing, I decided to bring it to the store. So this is made by a company called Renovo. They've specialized in water filtration for many years. I'm not sure how long the company's been around, but they're a fairly well-known name in the water purification industry. And so what we have here is a modular and adaptable, as they call it, water filtration system. And as you can see, there's three different levels that I have here. So this is the basic version. This is kind of the intermediate version. And this is the full meal deal. I'm gonna talk quickly about what all of these do and what they are and why this system is so unique and innovative. And so basically what this system provides is three levels of filtration. So it's gonna filter out chemicals, bacteria and viruses. And there is a pre-filter for particulate matter, but it also has numerous different delivery systems. So with these three filters and the various delivery systems, you get uh, many, many different possibilities with how you can actually use this device. Now, the most basic version is the Nomad version, and that's going to come with this bottle here, and you get this Nanolum water filter. And the Nanolum filter is going to filter out viruses, bacteria, and it's going to be very easy to use. So in order to use this, all you have to do is fill this up with water. You go into a lake, doesn't matter how dirty the water is, scoop some water in there, of course, it can't be salinated water. None of these do desalination. If you want a desalinator, I will post a link to uh, the Catadyne desalination system in the description if you're interested in that. It's a very expensive unit, and uh, you, you're probably better off just building some sort of solar still uh, or something like that to get the salt out of the water. But in terms of using this, scoop some water in there, attach the filter, stick it in there, and just drink it like you would a normal water bottle. So uh, very easy to use. And that's what this is all about. It's all about ease of use. So this one goes for about $35 Canadian. So it's very cheap and you're gonna get much greater filtration than you would out of a life straw. And of course you get the bottle. A lot of people go with the life straw because it's cheap, it's 20 bucks. And some people even go with the Sawyer water filter because it's cheap. But in terms of actual practical use, uh, it's much easier to use a bottle than it is one of those crinkly fold up uh, Sawyer water filtration things. That's not a bad filter. I'm not necessarily knocking it. But again, you're also not going to get the uh, Nanolum virus protection. That Nanolum is something which was created by NASA or it's based on technology which was created by NASA in order to filter out things down to 0.01 microns or something really small that viruses can't get through. So you're going to get your hollow fiber filter with those other uh, different filtration systems and that's going to get rid of the bacteria and you're going to be able to use that for up to 100,000 gallons or something like that. You get one of those with, the, with this one here. You don't get that with this. So this is good for, I believe it's 100 gallons. So you have a limited amount of uh, water that you can use it for. But uh, like I said, if you're going somewhere where the water is really dangerous, maybe there's uh, some sort of pandemic or something like that. You don't want to be contracting a virus or any sort of uh, hepatitis or something like that. Then that's something that you're going to want to look into. Now, if you want to step it up a notch, this is the survivalist filter. And I think they named it this way because me and several other preppers and survivalists did reviews for them. So this is basically it right here. So it looks a lot like a life straw, but what it is, it's a three stage filtration system. So whereas a life straw only filters out bacteria, this is going to provide you with the active carbon filtration. So that's going to take out the chemicals and the taste, most chemicals, the bad ones anyways, the heavy metals. This is going to, uh, this hollow fiber is going to last up to 100,000 liter so this is basically your life straw 100,000 gallons I should say this is your life straw this is your Sawyer and of course the nano lum which is going to take out everything so this is a three stage filtration system now there's a lot of redundancy here you don't necessarily need 
uh, the nanolum if you have the hollow fiber for 90% of the water that you're going to come across. But it's still good to have it on there just to be safe. And of course, you can use these in different ways. If you just want the active carbon filtration, so maybe you're drinking public water, but the taste isn't the greatest, you could just use that. If you just want to use bacterial protection, you put the hollow fiber. If you just want to use the active carbon and the nanolum so that you get a better tasting water with full protection, because remember, the nanolum is going to do what the hollow fiber is going to do. So there really is no point in using the hollow fiber with the nanolum, and yet unless you want that extra bit of protection. And now the great thing about this is that you get these end caps and these caps can screw on to any size water bottle and you can attach pre-filters in between all of the joints or all the modules. And uh, yeah, and then of course you get a spout so you can use it just like you would a life straw. There's also other attachments that you can get where you can attach a hose to the end here. So if you were drinking out of a creek, you wouldn't have to go all the way down into the creek or you wouldn't have to scoop water up in a cup and drink out of the cup. You could just drop the hose down into there. So that's a pretty cool feature. This uh, system is just, it's amazing. Uh, it basically covers every possible base that you would want covered for water filtration anyways. I would have to say that the survivalist is a really good one for the bug out roll. Now, if you wanted something for travel and something is really practical, maybe you are going on a trip or a backpacking adventure or something like that. Uh, this is going to be a great thing to put in there because of the practicality. There, there, not enough is said when it comes to water purification about the ease of use. Uh, which is why water tablets are actually a really practical way to go as well. And we're also going to be carrying those at the store. Although you might not want to overdo it on those. I mean, I've used them for days and days on end uh, without necessarily getting sick. But there are, there's certain drawbacks to everything. I would say that this is probably one of the easiest methods because you simply, you know, scoop some water in there and go to town. Now, with the Ultimate Eclipse system, so this is 35 bucks Canadian, which is around, I don't know, 25 bucks American. This is 80 bucks Canadian, which is around 60 bucks, maybe 55 bucks uh, American. The Eclipse package is 160. And what you get in the Eclipse package is pretty much everything. So you get everything that you get in these two, plus you get a uh, gravity filtration system and you get a hand pump system so that you can actually pump water so this is going to be something that you're going to want if you're going to be in a larger group because that gravity uh, fed water filtration system is really that's the most practical it's like this times 10 basically it's a big dry bag with uh, the adapter on it so that you can connect this inline filtration however you want and that's gonna allow you to use gravity to filter. So that's gonna spare you the energy of having to do it. That's probably the best way to do it. Now, if you can't, for whatever reason, uh, access a deep enough water, say, to uh, scoop in into that bag, then you can use the pump system, the hand pump system. So this is the hand pump system. Once again, fully modular. So, see here there's going to be a hose going into the water source and then this is going to be an output source and the hose is going to be going into that and you're just going to be pumping like so right and that's going to take water from one place and bring it to another and once you get it going it's actually relatively fast it definitely a good thing to have the, the complete system so that's what you get with the Eclipse system. You get inline filtration. What that is, is that if you had a water bladder, these attachments that they give you, the hose attachments are compatible with any water bladder system. So you can basically hook your filtration system up to your water bladder. And then there's another hose, which is going to go into your mouthpiece. So really just the, the most versatile, the most advanced water filtration system definitely is going to serve a vital spot in your bug out roll. So go check that out. I should also add that 
uh, pack rolls are in stock. We have all bug out rolls in stock. We have changed our design slightly. Uh, basically, it's going to be all vinyl windows now on the main section of the roll. If you do order a bug out roll from here on in, as per customer demand, it's going to be all vinyl windows. So there's going to be no open pockets anymore, uh, no unzippered pockets. It's going to be all straight vinyl and it's going to basically be all zippered with the heavy duty YKK zips. So go check that out. I will post a link in the description to the website. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Canadian Prepper out.